What's up guys, ViperFV here, and today I'm going to be showing you guys how to hack the DJI goggles to be able to allow you to go up to 1200 milliwatts uh, power output. And just let you guys know first before we continue, pretty much outputting 1200 milliwatts is illegal. Uh, so do this at your own risk. And this hack actually was just released about 24 hours ago, so it hasn't been really fully tested i mean i can definitely tell that is definitely putting out 1200 milliwatts because the air unit does get a lot hotter um now power consumption i've seen reports of anywhere from another 100 milliamps to another 200 milliamps so nothing too crazy um but let's go ahead and show you guys what you need to do to go ahead and enable this setting all right so we're on the computer and just want to let you know before we start with the hack you need to make sure that your FPV goggles and also the DJI air unit is also on the same firmware and updated to the newest version as of 11.1.2019. These are all the changes that they did make. So update it now if you haven't done so already. Uh, the new version is version 01.00.01.00. .01 so after you went ahead and you updated all your goggles and your air unit, uh, what you need to go ahead and do is we need to go ahead and make a text file. So right here, just open your notepad up and scroll down here and you want to name the file and save it as NACO underscore PWR. And then you have two options. So you can go PWR underscore two. This will unlock where you can pick either from the 1000 milliwatts or the 1200 milliwatts. Or if you just want to do PWR underscore one, you have the option of just doing a thousand milliwatts. So it's up to you which one you want to go ahead and do, but I'm going to go ahead and do the two. So I have the option of doing both. And then you want to go ahead and do is click save. And then you want to go ahead and get an SD card. Actually, you want to go ahead and make sure you save that as so save as then go ahead and go to, you know, save it somewhere on your desktop and then just save it and this. Yeah, go ahead and override it. That's fine. So once you have that, go ahead and go onto your computer where your SD card is inserted. So I have mine right here, my drive H. And let's go ahead and delete that as well. I don't need that. So you make sure it's a clear card so it doesn't have anything else on it. We're going to go ahead and close that up. And we're going to go ahead and drag this right to the root of the SD card. And then we're going to go ahead and close it up. And then we're going to go ahead and insert it in the DJI goggles. And then it's going to go ahead and update for a couple seconds, and then you should be seeing it in your goggles. Um, right here, we are looking at the DJI Air Unit goggles, and as you can see, I have the 1000 milliwatts and also the 1200 milliwatts selected. I would recommend keeping the limit here on, just in case, uh, so you can have it, you know, power limit, just in case, you know, when you're disarmed, it's not using all that voltage and heating up your Air Unit for no reason. Well, guys, that should do it for the DJI Digital FPV system hack to increase your milliwatts. Now, if you don't already know, what increasing your milliwatts is, is it does increase your range and it does increase your penetration behind trees and objects. So increasing your milliwatts should definitely help out if you're having some problems, especially in some questionable areas. But uh, just keep in mind that it is illegal in pretty much any country in the entire world because it is a high output. I'm not sure if the goggles are outputting 1200 milliwatts uh, because it does do, you know, both ways, the DJI goggles. I'm assuming it might because how else will it communicate with the actual air unit, um, especially if it's out of the range it's normally at. But that's up to speculation at this point since it is a, still a new type of feature or hack that just came out not even a day ago. But if you did find this video helpful, go ahead and give it a like. Subscribe to my YouTube channel. I do tons of beta flight tutorials along with builds and everything in between. And I will be leaving a link to the DJI digital FPV system down below. Um, if you haven't already picked one up, go ahead and check it out, take a look at it, and let me know what you guys think in the comments down below. I am definitely interested to see if you guys will be trying this hack and uh, see what your results are. Uh, but for let's go ahead and uh, end the video now, and I'll see you guys in a future video. Peace.